freak soon. Have you seen the new photos, the most recent photos of Husamar Palhares? Oh, yeah, yeah. He was grappling, dude. He's just looking. Fucking Christ. He looks like he's 250 pounds. Dude, if that guy tripped and fell, I would just seriously just run out the room, dude. <laughs> I would like, fuck that, dude. There's no way, man. I mean, those guys are tapping before, dude. And yeah, just it doesn't matter. Shit off, he dude. just tears your shit apart. That's insane, man. He's so fucking thick right now. He's only like 5'7", and he's probably, no bullshit, 230 pounds. He's enormous right now. Yeah. God bless him, dude. So. <laughs> That guy's scary, man. Fuck. Well, now that he's uh, not testing, look at him right there. Jesus Christ. God. I mean, that's a legitimate 225 pounds at 5'7". Five, 5'7". Seven. Five, seven. <laughs> yeah. I'm way bigger than it, man. That's crazy. Yeah, it's dude. crazy. I mean, dude, that's... I'm short. I'm 5'8", and I stand, I'm taller than that dude. But he's like a foot wider than me. Yeah, and you get after it. I see you on the onnits and always always getting after it. You know, maybe after I retire from fighting, I'm just going to get on the juice and just look like that. Just get teach, jacked. Teach class. <laughs> just so do get, fucking strongman go, competitions. Ankle locks all day. Carry cars and shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. You ever get caught under a car, Paul Harris might be the guy that you want right there. Yeah, d he's ridiculously steroids. big right now. Yeah, that's steroids. definitely steroids. 100%. For sure. 100%. You don't gain that much weight. I mean, the last time he fought was like a year ago, and he was fighting at 170. Yeah. And now, I mean, obviously, a lot of guys that fight at 170, they really weigh the 190s, somewhere around there, and then they cut weight to get down to 170, but that is just gigantic. Yeah, dude, that's that's too much, man. He's a fucking awesome jiu-jitsu player, too. It's not just strong. Yeah. He's got some serious, legit technique. Yeah, my... Uh one of my uh, guy who gave him a purple belt, uh, Dean Lister. You know he he's uh, he's been still going at and competing. I know he just lost and everything, but uh, that's just outstanding. Dude, Dean's Dean's very good. Dude, he he's a big dude, but he rolls like a little guy, and he's just freakishly strong, man. Yeah, he's a very smart. Dean knows a lot about jujitsu, and he's yeah. one of the reasons why you know the whole John Donaher, Henzo Gracie team got so good at leg locks. A lot of that was the influence of Dean Lister. Dean Lister went down there and did some training with them, and Dean has been a leg lock master from the old days. Like he was one of those guys that was leg locking people in the early days of Abu Dhabi. Yep. Back in the early two thousands, yeah. you know, when people like the leg lock game has shifted over the last few years and it's become incredibly dominant there's so many guys that are winning like jujitsu has become a largely like a game of like 60 maybe even more percent leg locks especially no gi like the eddie cummins gary tonin yep. all these guys from john donaher's camp there's yep. so many guys down down there that are just really talented at attacking legs yeah and not a lot of people like that you it's know, a it's sophisticated a it's a game. yeah yeah when you start playing with the legs you know it's scary yeah, yeah. it is Everybody, yeah oh, oh, oh. Yeah, nobody likes getting crippled. No. But, but, you know, like Eddie Bravo had a really good point. He's like, well, is it okay if someone yanks on your neck? Is it okay if someone breaks your arm? Like, it's what is the difference? Like, just, just you got to tap before you get fucked up. Yep. <laughs> Which yep. is easier if said than Paul, done. Paul Harris is on there. You, you, you tap all day, but that guy yeah. is ripping it, dude. Yeah, he is tearing people's yeah. knees apart. Yeah, that's kind of bullshit. But. Yeah, it is kind of, well, it's definitely bullshit when people tap, yeah, right? Yeah. It is definitely bullshit when people tap. Do you 